Hello everyone, this is Akhilesh from DataSense and welcome to our course on Power Query. Before going into Power Query, let us understand the main need. So whenever you think of creating any reports or a dashboard or whenever you want to perform any sort of data analysis, the first thing which you will need is your data set. If you don't have that data set, you will try to get it from some systems, download it from some ERPs or maybe some Excel or CSV files. Now, getting the data is first step, but then you may require to clean that data set so that it's usable for your further needs like pivot tables, Power BI or Power Pivots. And if it is not clean, then you will perform so many manual steps to make it clean. So there comes Power Query. Now, what is Power Query? So basically, Power Query is an ETL tool. What is ETL? E stands for Extract, T for Transform, and L for Load. So it extracts data from 100 plus data sources. Then it has capabilities to transform your data sets as per your needs. Then once it is clean or it is ready to use, then it can load your data to pivot tables or maybe a simple Excel sheet or Power Pivots or Power BI also. Power Query is available in both the places, Excel as well as Power BI. And it requires your Excel version to be 2013 or newer versions of Excel. In 2013, it is an add-on. You need to install it yourself. But from 2016 onwards, Power Query is inbuilt in your data tab. So you can find it in the data tab where get and transform data is mentioned. So what all things Power Query can do? When we talk about extract it is capable of connecting with 100 plus data sources and those includes databases your files like excel csv text file it can talk to pdf files it can extract data from a folder it can extract data from google analytics facebook linkedin your mail exchange and so many other places it can even get data from various websites like wikipedia or any public websites which allows you to get that data then comes the transformation part. So it is capable of changing your columns, your rows and your tables. Sometimes you would delete some columns. Sometimes you will rename them. Sometimes you need to delete some rows from the top, sometimes in between blank rows and many a times at the bottom of the section. All these problems are there in the data sets which we download from some systems or when we get it from other departments which are not maintaining the data properly. Power Query can also help you to consolidate datasets from various sheets into one single sheet, multiple files with multiple sheets into one single sheet or a table. And same is also possible even if your data is coming from multiple places. Maybe you are getting the similar kind of data set, some from your database, some from your files, and it can combine both of them into one single place, as long as you have something common between them. And the best part is you don't need to know any programming to automate your data cleaning process. Whatever you will be doing, you will be doing using the user interface, which is very easy to use. And Power Query will remember all the steps which you have done. So next time it will be just a single click to do the same task again. And once it is clean, you can use that data set in the form of a sheet or you can pass it on to a pivot table Power Pivots or Power BI. And after that, you know that journey. So stay tuned and we will learn all these things in detail. Thanks for your time. See you in the next video.